everyone, it's Nicole coming at you with a little haul. Um, I actually did a couple of videos on um, some things that I had hauled uh, a little while ago, but I'm having trouble actually converting it over so that I could upload them, so I, en I may end up having to take everything out where I've put it up and try to do it again, so I'm working on that. But I also have this little mini haul that I wanted to bring to you so I could actually upload something, because I haven't in a minute. Well, this one actually is a haul from BH Cosmetics and The Beauty Supply. So I'm going to start with The Beauty Supply. Uh, I went by there because I'm trying to make a wig. I'm in the process of doing that, so I had to actually get something for that. And I picked up a couple things. Um, I picked up the 3D Face Creator. Now, I've had this before, but I didn't. I ended up giving it to my daughter. So I wanted to actually experiment with it again. When I used it before, I can't really didn't know what I was doing. So I decided to pick up another one. And, of course, you've seen this all over the place. This was a really popular... Uh, I want to say a couple years ago when um, they were discovered and people started doing a lot with them. So I got this one. This is in a level 10 and it was $4.99 at my beauty supply. And hopefully the camera will zoom in and you can see it. I'm using a different one so I don't know how it's working. It's kind of frustrating. But anyway, I got that. And then I also picked up the Ruby Kisses uh, palette, the little palette with the mirror, because I actually got some shadows before I bought the palette because I wasn't sure if I was going to like them. So they're kind of slipping and sliding in the drawer, so I went ahead and got the palette for that. It was $1.99, so I'm going to pop those in. So these are really nice, um, and the shadows as well are really nice. Uh, I got the dome cap because I was going to, like I said, well, I am in the process of... And so I wanted to see if there was a difference between the dome cap that I had <laughs> and some of the ones that are out there still, a different brand or whatever. So I picked up this. So that was something that I grabbed. And I picked up some more um, of the J-Cat lipstick and lip gloss. Now, like I was saying earlier, I hauled some J-Cat lipsticks before in a video but I'm having issues with it uploading or converting it over and so forth so anyway I really liked it so I picked up a lip glaze and it looks almost like one of the MAC lip glasses um, that I had a while ago and oh gosh I think it was called Nympho the color from MAC was called Nympho this one is SLG 124 and it is Hollywood. It's called Hollywood. Um, and with that little security tag that they stick on these things, it's going to be hard for you to see that color probably. But yeah, this is the packaging. And hopefully you can actually see the gloss when I swatch. But I like that gloss from MAC a whole lot. And uh, I wanted to see if I could get something similar or whatever. Now, it's not showing up a whole lot on my hand with me swatching it. Hopefully you can see that. But it's more of a sort of sheer nude, I guess, on my hand. There's a little more pigmentation in the MAC one, obviously, but <laughs> this is the one from J-Cat. And then I also picked up a, another lipstick, um, and this one's called Vivid Rose, and this is the one that I'm wearing on my lips right now. And this is what it looks like in the tube. And, of course, um, you see it on me, so I don't need to swatch it. But I do like the lipstick. Um, this is matte. I think there are some that I saw that were a little frosty or had a little shimmer to them. But I really like the, the matte ones. I'm not a frost person that much. So, yeah. Now, moving on to the BH Cosmetics haul. Um, they had one of those little specials going where you get... Um, palettes and brushes and stuff like that. So they had the uh, Take Me to Brazil palette and the uh, Eyes on the 60s palette and then you got a brush set with it which is, I want to say it's this one. I've gotten so many brush sets here lately. Yeah. <laughs> it's the purple croc, faux croc I think it was called set. A travel set and it looks like this. 
And if I'm wrong, forgive me, but I actually had a couple orders that came with the brush set, so I may have gotten it mixed up, but I believe this is it. So anyway, <laughs> this is the brush set that you get. And it comes in a little travel pouch or whatever. So great to stick in your purse or in a kit or whatever you want to do with it. Nice to have. Nice quality. And I'm sure you've seen that before. Um, and of course you've seen the Take Me to Brazil palette. So I've gotten this. This is the second one. I actually have. I ordered it separately. And so when I saw this deal, you couldn't leave it. Because I want to say it was 15 something. And you got all those. I want to say that. I wish I had the receipt. I call myself keeping the little... Um, Let's see, is this it? Nope, that's my Coastal Scents one. Well, sorry, y'all. <laughs> but anyway, this is um, the Take Me to Brazil palette, and you've already seen that. Um, the Eyes on the 60s palette, I've seen mixed reviews, but I actually like it. Um, and here it is. Has some beautiful shadows in it. Oops, let's see if I can take this glass off so you can see. But it has some really pretty colors, and I like those. I think those are cute. It'll be fun to work with during the summer, the bright colors or whatever. So yeah, glad to get that. Um, I haven't decided what I'm gonna do with the second Take Me to Brazil. I may put it in a giveaway or something. I don't know, but I'm loving that palette. Really loving Take Me to Brazil. And I also ordered the. 120 palette. This is the fifth edition. I think I have the second edition. I'd like to get them all eventually. And I just missed out on the sale where there were $12 a piece or whatever, but I'm sure they'll go on sale again. And I'll try to grab the whole collection. But I got the fifth edition. And uh, it comes in a box like that, or in a package like this. And I'll fit you in the box. This is the box. <laughs> that it comes in and it shows you all the colors here on the back and what the palette looks like and let me open it for you and of course it has a mirror and then on the first tray you get these pretty colors love those and then you lift it off Oops, I actually lifted both out. You lift it off. And then you get these pretty colors. I don't want to tip over. But yeah, that's what you get in the second tray. So these are really nice palettes. And again, if you're like a uh, MUA or whatever, I would assume these would be okay for your palette. Or if you're a MUE, a <laughs> makeup enthusiast, this would be um, a great addition to your collection. So, yeah, that's what I grabbed. That was my little haul. I think that's everything. Yeah, just a little one compared to all the other ones that I've had. But, yeah, so if you have any questions about any of the items that I picked up, again, feel free to hit me up. Um, and I guess that's it. So, until my next one, I'll see you then. Bye, y'all.